So um, I've now closed, um, sorry, I've now soldered uh, all the um, points for the lower PCB and um, I was just about to close it and I thought I'll include a little bit more notes on uh, a couple of things. So the first thing is, um, the on the upper PCB, just before you um, close it, there's a resistor to check. Um, and so this is how you will take the PCB off. So if you turn it around, you'll notice here um, you have a resistor, uh, which, a, which is, a, um, I believe, a 70 ohm or 4.7 kilo ohm resistor. Uh, I'm not sure what the actual value is. But um, the point I want to mention here is that this particular resistor you need to check if it's broken or damaged or um, on either side and if it is then this needs replacing as well um, not sure what the value is on this one actually I do um, it's 4.7 ohm so uh, and I have brought up a document just to let, give a little bit more information now I also I said in the previous video that sometimes it's the um, uh, the MOSFET that's also uh, damaged, which is um, this one here. And uh, I'm not replacing that until um, I power it on, check with the new transformer, see if everything is okay. If it's not, then I'll come back and replace this as well. But here's what it says in the document. So um, you have the resistor here. And um, I didn't know the value, but it says it there, right, right there, 4.7 ohm. And it says if the resistor is broken, then the MOSFET buzz uh, or Bravo Uniform Zulu 1 or 2S will be broken too. Now, I have come across um, cases on the forums where people say they've taken the instrument cluster off and they can hear a rattle in that. And that's usually this, um, this particular MOSFET that's broken and it's uh, fallen off. And in those cases, almost everybody agrees that both MOSFETs should be changed rather than just one of them. So, um, um, in this case at the moment, I've I just got this one with the kit. So, um, so there's the resistor, which I've just shown you, and um, that's the value 4.7 ohm, and um, that's the MOSFET. So I'm now going to close uh, everything in reverse order to what I've already recorded in the videos and power on and share some further notes. Um, thank you for watching the video.